we're going to use this device to measure the hematocrit, which you can actually estimate simply by looking at the column of blood and estimating what proportion the packed red blood cells is of the total blood volume. That's what the hematocrit is. Uh, using this device, you're going to take your microcapillary tube, and with the bottom of the tube, the bottom of the column of blood, uh, uh, touching the black line at the top of the instrument in this little plastic. This is the bottom of the column of blood here. Um, place the capillary tube in this little, little slot. You are then going to take the bottom wheel and move it until the red line uh, reads 100. Mm -hmm. Can you stop it for a second? Holding the bottom plate in place, you are going to move the top plate until the spiral line meets the top of the column of plasma, of the column of blood at the top of where the plasma is. And if you're looking at it from this angle, it's even below the line. So, oh. I, I mean, it doesn't have to be so exact, but, but if, if, they're, if they're just not looking at it at a camera, they're looking this way, just above it, that's right above it, is, is the top of the line. Okay, perfect. Okay. Okay, perfect. Okay. Then, moving both plates together, uh, move the spiral line until it reaches the intersection of the red blood cell column and the plasma. The number that you see is the hematocrit. In this case, 43%. Remove the capillary tube, push it forward, and then just grasp it at the end. Remember to dispose of all sharps, uh, including slides, Pasteur pipettes, capillary tubes, um, needles, of course, in the sharps container.